Around a Small Mountain is uh, the newest film. Some say, unhappily, it might be the last film of Jacques Rivette, because unhappily not very well right now, and people said this will probably be his final film, which would, of course, be a great loss to cinema. Around a Small Mountain is a film that picks up on themes that, again, one has found in Rivette's films over the last 50 years, especially the relationship between film and theater and life and performance. These are the two kind of overwhelming themes in Rivette's work. And here he visits them again, although from a very limited, very kind of concentrated point of view. It's really the story about a small traveling circus, something that seems rather anachronistic in a way, winding its way through the sort of mountainous regions, the sort of border region between France and Switzerland, visiting small towns and doing performances, knowing that this is going to be their final tour. And in that way, the film takes on a very elegiac quality, now that we know it'll probably be Rivette's final tour as well, where in a sense he's trying to, at one point, not only tell you the stories about these characters, but trying to sum up a lifetime of filmmaking and speculation about these various themes in the kind of encounters between his characters. There's an extraordinary ending to the film, which I won't give away, but it's really watching an artist really try and put all these ideas and themes together and really present them to us in a very, very satisfying way. So again, those who love films that really deal with intimate relationships, that deal with characters who are a little bit unexpected, with situations that are somewhat out of the ordinary, yet all of them having things that are very recognizable to our daily lives, will in fact, I think, find a way that this film will enter their hearts.